So are you experiencing drafts coming in from your windows? Is there any way to solve this? There actually is. Let's talk about it. So first, what causes drafts to be coming in around your windows? Well, it could be several things, but the most common are, it could be damage. One thing, if you have either you know high winds or branches or something that may have hit the window, if it's damaged, always keep an eye on that. But the more realistic, it could just be the age of the windows. You gotta remember materials do break down over time. Or if you have older metal windows, including the window box and the framing and trimming and flashing as well, all of that over time, if that's not maintained properly, that can get more and more difficult to operate and that can cause issues. The other thing is, if it was installed improperly, or if the window box or the window frame was not air sealed properly when it was installed. These are all common things that can lead to drafty windows. Now the first common way that you can solve a drafty window is to use some type of sealant to either get something like a caulk, a silicone, a putty, or even a can foam, and you wanna air seal around that entire window frame. Now this may involve you having to remove parts of the window trim, probably the window sill, so that you can actually get to the window frame itself. And then just as simply taking that sealant and going around all the joints, all the places where things come together. Again, that's an easy place where things can separate over time or even when they're first installed and then air will get through those and ultimately make its way into your home. So again, you just want to expose all those joints and junctions and make sure you treat them with a sealant. This is a very common way. It is a little bit invasive. Like I said, you may have to take off trim or sill plates and things like that to get to it. So you may have to be a little bit handy and it can be messy anytime you deal with sealants, but this is relatively inexpensive. It just takes a little bit of time to do. Now, the next thing to consider, let's say you've already tried some sealants. Let's say you've tried to air seal around the, the window frame itself and the trimmings and things like that, and it just isn't doing the trick. Well, it could mean a couple different things. It could just mean that the way the window is designed or installed is just you know, inherently flawed and you're just chasing a problem. Or there could be some type of damage or over time it's degraded to the point that you're just going to have to continually put band-aids on it. When you get to that point, you may just have to consider replacing those windows. Now, unfortunately, yes, this can be a very expensive venture if you have to do the entire home. If you just have to do one or two windows, this isn't nearly as expensive, obviously. But when you get to that point, unfortunately, that's that's really the only way to totally solve the problem. There are some other things you can do, like you can plastic off the window, and that will obviously cut off drafts. The obvious downside to that is now you have plastic over your windows, so you may not like the look of that, during certain seasons or again it can affect different things in the house so to really solve the problem once you've tried those minor things the only step to really consider is usually replacing the window so these are some things to keep in mind if you're experiencing drafty windows and you've already tried different solutions now something I want you to keep in mind if you are experiencing drafts around your windows is this could be a sign of bigger problems meaning you could just have a lot of air movement inside that wall assembly meaning outside air is somehow getting into your walls and is just coming in around your windows. So what you may have to do is really look at establishing your building envelope. And this is where something like foam insulation can really come into play and help cut down that air infiltration from getting into your walls in the first place. Now, again, you may still have to address those windows specifically, but that is a sign that you may have other things to look at in your house. If you wanna reach out to a dealer and learn more what foam can do to help your house be more comfortable and cut down on drafts, check out the link below. Go to our Find a Dealer page where you can find your local retro foam dealer. This is the Professor of Foam reminding you that building is a science.